Today we'll be looking at the HUD changes for League of Legends. This will be coming out in the upcoming patch for League. And uh, I'm going to start off right now. We're going to be looking at the, the buy menus here. This is really updated and it's just, I think it's better in every way. In my honest opinion, it's better than every way. Uh, before you used to have six things in the top right corner that you, you know, recommended items that you buy. Now you actually have different sections here. You see we have starting items, essential items, offensive items, and defensive items. So, I mean, also these are bots, so I'm not actually leaving anybody alone, so don't worry about me uh, leaving some teammates out to dry when I'm showing you guys this. But anyways, uh, so you do have actually different sections here now. So these are what you rec they recommend to you for, you know, starting items. You can see that there's, there's three now. So you have a little bit, the, the newbies probably have a little bit more help there. If you just want to get some starting items right off the bat, these is, this is what you get. You don't have to go on mobile fire to, to look it up, even though you, you're probably going to be better off doing that. But uh, this will help the uh, new players very much so. So that's just great. It's just great. This is, this is perfect. I love it a lot. And uh, you can see that we have uh, offensive items. If you, want to, if you want to build this character defensive, you can obviously build defensive. Or you could go complete offense. Whatever, you, whatever floats your boat, right? So you can see there's different sections there. Very good stuff. Uh, as for all items here, if you want to search for an item, there's a search functionality now. So I'm going to search for a Trinity Force. There's Trinity Force. Click on it and you can see everything that builds into it. Uh, everything just looks overall nicer, nicer colors. It's easier to look at. It just looks better in every way. Uh, we can see we, we, if you want to search for certain stats, you can search for several stats. So if you want to search for an item that has health, uh, damage, and critical strike. There you go, you can see the only item in the game that has health, damage, and critical strike is a Trinity Force. And just like for any stats, like, uh, you know, you can you can search for whatever stats together and, and find them. And there's also a consumable section down here. All that new stuff. Also has some new items here, which I'm not going to be covering in this video, but yes, uh, there is some, some new stuff. There's different, different ways to look at these here. Um, we have the smaller grid and the larger list. You know, whatever floats your boat, right? As soon as you get used to the game, it's probably what you're going to be using the, uh, the smaller grid one. But it just looks very nice. This is the buy menu. The buy menu is just great. I love it. And uh, here we have for the down, down the bottom here, we can see these pluses are a lot bigger. Definitely are a lot bigger. And uh, you can see, like, for the Q, watch my Q. I'm going to upgrade my Q here. I'm going to upgrade my Q to level 1. And watch my Q. There's going to be a little icon that comes up or a little, like... You can see that it actually put one in there. You can see that I'm, I know that I'm level one. I don't have to hover over it to look to see if I'm level one. I already know that I'm level one. So that's just great. That, that'll actually, it's just, just something that's really useful. You don't have to hover over your skills anymore to see what level it is. You just know just by looking down, down there. So it's great. Uh, over here are XP bars here in the bottom left corner. Um, everything just, just cleaned up and, and made better in every way. Uh, this champion info and camera settings and everything, it's no longer down here. It's actually up here, uh, like on your mini map, I guess. And I need to, I just need to move for a second. I want to get disconnected, even though I'm playing as bots. But, I mean, that's basically it. The HUD is just improved in every way. And it's just awesome. Honestly, it's just awesome. I can't wait for this to fully be released on the, uh, the actual game. Because right now, as of this video, it's only released on the PBE. But it should be released in the actual game here pretty soon. Also, this champion, if you guys are wondering what it is, I will be making a video on her as well. She's brand new, like brand spick and new release in the PPE. So uh, you guys will see a video on that uh, fairly shortly, probably the same day that this video is released. So there's that. Uh, the HUD, just great. HUD, uh, user interface, excellent, and I'm loving it. Can't wait for it to be released.